Uh oh. What's up, guys? Me, Devin. I know I'm supposed to take a break on a week, but this dude's freaking funny. Sub with him. Bro, you see something? The top has got his user. I'm um, not username. Um, his YouTube channel. Subscribe to him, bro. I'm putting the link. You already right, know. Let's start. Start. And plushies are now on oh, sale plus. along oh, with the hand plushies, plushies. Very, um, but supplies are plushies. very limited and if they sell anything like they did last time you have about one day to buy one or they're gone especially the bryson one also there's a hand pin and a bryson pin use the link in the description or the merch shelf to get one now okay on to the video Funny. My first kiss. My first kiss, Mike. <laughs> okay, okay. Here we go. Oh okay, gosh, it hurts. Why am I doing this? Oh. Okay, let's go. It all started in seventh grade PE class. I think I hear that we were playing from, flag I football. Really care, I honestly really. forgot all the rules because I suck at sports, but I know if you pull someone's flags, they are out. Now, even though I suck at sports, there was a girl on the other team that was even worse at sports than me. So, I pulled her flag and kept playing the game. But, as the game went on, I kept seeing her, so I kept pulling her flag over and over. After like the fifth time of doing this, she jokingly said, Do we have a problem? No. Then why do you keep pulling my flag? <laughs> uh, what can I say? You're an easy target. And I walked off. <laughs> I got it! I got it! <laughs> Now, I had never noticed this girl before, but apparently she had been in my homeroom class the entire year, and she quickly became part of my friend circle. My friend circle consisted of the triplets, Cole, Travis, and Ava, and now the new girl, Soraya. We would walk to and from school, hang out at lunchtime, and me and Soraya would team up in PE games. Eventually, me and Soraya started to develop feelings for each other. Okay. After a while, my child mind thought, hmm, this must be true love for sure. I shall text her my feelings. Instead of talking to her like a normal person, I decided to just text her, Hey, I love you. <laughs> and that's not even the most hey, cringy part. It gets worse. Anyways, she texted me back and was like, I love you too. And baby oh Bryson was like, Haha, yes, I'm in. The next day at school, we just kind of awkwardly knew that we loved each other, and nothing really happened until one day, my parents sat me down and told me that we were moving away from California. I was pretty sad because these were the best friends That's I had ever sad. had. A few days later, all of us That's were walking home from school. Right? Me and Travis that, right? were talking about how bummed we were that I had to move, and then I said, before I move away, I want to kiss Soraya. Travis said, you want to kiss her now? No, 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 not now. You're doing it now. No! Cole, Ava, I forgot that mom wanted us to come home really fast because, uh, because of a thing. So hurry up, let's all conveniently run away so Bryson and Soraya are alone. And they were gone. <laughs> and there me and Soraya were, alone, together. together. After probably a solid minute of me trying to build up the courage, I finally said, uh, Soraya? I, uh, I would be mad at myself if I didn't do this. I closed my eyes, puckered up, and made a move. Okay, pause for a second. Here's an important oh, detail to remember. Soraya was taller than me. Oh. Most people are. <laughs> so that, combined with my underdeveloped motor skills, meant... What? She tall. She, is she gonna kiss her in her face? Can't go with them out, right? You gonna kiss her face? She taller than you. I missed her lips and I ended it. up kissing her on it. the cheek. I missed! What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Run Soraya away. blushed and awkwardly <laughs> said thanks, but I felt like the world's biggest idiot. And I'm positive that she knew how embarrassed I was because I don't know why, but my ears turn red when I'm embarrassed. Like, bright red. Anyways, I don't remember what we said after, but I know it was awkward. I think I said something like, sorry about that, or that was dumb, I shouldn't have. When all of a sudden, Soraya grabbed me by the shoulders, Ooh. looked me in the eyes, and... Okay. What? What? <laughs> what, 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 what? <laughs> Soraya ran off. <laughs> Dang. I walked into really Cole, like Travis, that. and Ava's house and told them everything. 
I was so embarrassed. My ears were probably glowing. Even their glowing. mom was there, and I told her everything too because she's like a second mom to me. It was so embarrassing. Second mom. Anyways, want to hear about my love mom, life now? I I have my own. Want to hear about it again? Seriously, me. I graduated from high school and I'm yet to be in a relationship with another girl, and I'm fine with that, honestly. I mean, I'm 18 currently, and I look like I'm 13, so usually girls view me as a friend Sad. slash little brother, so every time I meet a girl, I go directly I'm to the sure friend too. zone. Everyone okay. complains we about the friend zone, but honestly, I think it's fine. There's no drama, you're still friends with the person, and you have time to think about other stuff. Also, I looked it up, and only about 5% of middle school and high school romances actually last. So what's the point? I mean, unless you view dating as practicing for when you do find someone you're serious about, but that's honestly a pretty messed up way to view people. That's how you break people's hearts or get your heart broken. I don't think dating seriously in high school should be encouraged because high schoolers usually aren't mentally developed enough to handle it properly. In my experience, high schoolers are just children in adult bodies. However, obviously, I'm an adult <laughs> in a child's body. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, there's some romantic advice from someone who has had little to no romantic experience. Use at your own risk. Okay, that was embarrassing. I try not to think about it too much because otherwise I get sucked into the infinity cringe. Just learn from your experiences and don't be dumb. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> hey, what's up, ham chunkers? It's me, your boy. Br Bro, subscribe this dude. I'm literally gonna put two link is his channel. In his own oh, video, but f that's freaking funny. Literally, I'm gonna say it one more time. You look something up, and you see like on his channel. That's his channel. Put in the link subscription. But I never know how to get the circle eye thing in the top. But yeah. See y'all later. Stay home. Have fun and boo boo.